All right, I've begun work on the dragon head. Um, the head is going to change direction, so to keep the carving oriented with grain direction, I have to put two large pieces of wood together. These are uh, 8 by 15 cedar mammoth hunks of wood. Um, the tail is much smaller. And in order to do that, I need to connect them. I also need to be able to connect the head to the playhouse. The curved ridge beam extends beyond the plane of the two gable walls acting as a tenon. So I need to make a mortise for those two to connect together. Um, two reasons why I'm doing that. One, it would be enormously expensive and heavy to have a ridge beam of an 8x15. The other reason why is that taking this down the road, the dragon head will be too high. It would be snagging wires left and right. I would cause a blackout, you know, in my wake. Um, so I have to take the dragon head off during transport. Um, so this machine is a chainsaw mortiser. Uh, it's used in timber framing. Luckily, I have a timber framing friend, and I was able to borrow it from him. Um, I did the uh, tail already, and it was just a dream because uh, the amount of work this thing saves is incredible. Uh, the mortise I'm going to make, you can't quite see it, but it's um, 12 inches long at the bottom. I'm not an engineer, but I'm just guessing that's going to be more than adequate to support the weight, which thankfully will be much less than these two pieces of wood because I'm going to be taking a lot of wood away and the carving. Um, but uh, I figure we plug this sucker in and show you how it works. It's pretty fun.
Pretty neat toy. That would have taken a lot of work with an auger and chisel. I have to do that a bunch more times and then I will have to use an auger and chisel for the last part because this only cuts a little less than 8 inches. Um, but saves me a ton of work. Alright, I'll show you uh, what it looks like when it's done.